A visit to see the critically endangered mountain gorillas of Uganda has been a dream of mine for many years. And that dream is about to come true. Here's the alpha male, silverback. He's coming down out of the tree. And hopefully he's gonna be really nice to us. Wow, this is awesome. This is, this is what oh, I've been waiting for a long time. There's nothing like seeing these guys in the wild. The gorilla is one of our closest living relatives, sharing 98.4% of our DNA. And just like us, they are fiercely protective of their young. It's going to be very tempting if a little baby gorilla comes very close. I want to be able to put my arms around one. No, it can touch on you, but you don't touch back. If you still love your faces to be pretty, don't touch back. At last count, there are just over 1,000 gorillas left in the wild. Almost half of the population are here in Uganda, where we are trekking in the Bwindi Impenetrable National Forest. What should we do when we come face to face with a silverback? What you do if you get face to face with a silverback, just come, come down and then everything is settled. Mountain gorillas are really, really special, beautiful creatures because they are only found in three countries in the whole world, which is Rwanda, Congo and Uganda. They are really, really wonderful. Even today when you go there, you are going to see that it's really extraordinary. We're about to head out on our second gorilla trek. So this is the second time we've uh, been looking for the uh, Ugandan uh, mountain gorilla and we're very excited of course. We've been told there are six habituated gorilla groups so we've been assigned to one of those groups to track today. I'm not sure how long it's going to be uh, taking us but uh, ready for another exciting day. Can't wait. We walk a small distance and then wait while our guide radios ahead to trackers who locate the gorilla family we are going to meet today. In the Businje we have uh, 10 members and uh, there used to be eight. Recently one of the females was grabbed from a certain group. So now there are 10, 10 members. Silverback is peaceful silverback and the group was named after. Uh, the silverback. He rarely charges. After those comforting words from our head ranger, we head off on our adventure to meet silverback Businji and his family. After five hours of cutting our way through thick bush and uneven terrain, the moment we have all been waiting for has arrived. Then, something extraordinary happens. Yeah, you hold your things tightly. As heart-racing a moment as this was, we were assured by the guide that this little juvenile was only playing. Mm -hmm. 
This would have to be without a doubt the most exciting, heartwarming, adrenaline pumping animal adventure I have had in my life. And I've had a few. I will never forget my visit to see the mountain gorillas in Uganda. They were so graceful and accepting of us. Moments that will be etched in my heart forever.